Are your customers tickled pink? Are with you, with your service, with your brand, with your company, are they tickled pink ever? Tickled pink means that they're excited, they're delighted, they're surprised. They are so excited and happy and it, the, 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 the speechless, delighted with your service or your products that they are literally tickled pink or they're so happy, so delighted that they want to tell other people about it. When is the last time, if ever, you had absolutely positively raving fan delighted customers with something that you did, your company or your brand did for them? I was thinking about this this morning. I was trying to think of when was the last time I was actually excited or tickled pink with or surprised even in a positive way with the service or the product that I received from a company. Now I'm involved with a couple of marketing organizations that purposefully, and this is why I'm talking about this today, purposefully do things to surprise and delight their customers. They will send them just surprise random gifts in the mail or um, not just discounts, but reminders of service or something that would be of value to them. It's how we build relationships. We contact people when we think of them and let them know, hey, I read this article, I was thinking of you. Take a look at this. Does this, you know, is this anything that could serve you? And I I had to think for several minutes about the last time I was delighted with an organization, a company, or a brand. Now, interestingly enough, it wasn't hard for me to think of the times that I have been less than satisfied or frustrated or not at all happy or pleased with a company or an organization. I could easily pop off 10 or 12 examples of companies that had really irritated me lately or brands that had done something that was just ridiculous and caused me to no longer do business with them. But as far as people going above and beyond to make me feel delighted and excited, I actually had to think about it. And I thought of a couple of really cool things. It's the turndown service or the mints at the hotel that you go to. It's the flowers that you receive from a friend or an acquaintance just out of the blue to let them know that they're thinking about you. It's the the surprise little shapes that your towels are folded into. If you've ever been on a cruise ship, you come back to your room after dinner and there's a little elephant or Mickey Mouse ears or all kinds of little things they, they fold the towels into and they turned on your bed and they put the mints there. And that tickled me pink. That is something that it goes above and beyond what you would expect, but in a delightful, happy way. So you want to stand out. You want to be better than the competition. You want customers that love and adore you. Just start thinking about them and what would tickle them pink? What would excite them? What would surprise them in a positive way? And you want to be doing these things proactively and randomly because stuff's going to happen. Your business is going to screw up. You're going to make mistakes. You're going to irritate people and you want to have a bank of positive things built up. So if a negative thing happens to happen to them, because we're all human and it's going to happen, um, they don't, they don't abandon you and they don't go to the competition because you've already built up this relationship of good feeling, good examples, good things that you've done for them above and beyond what they would expect from anyone else. Think of the time when you've taken your car into a place to be serviced and you got your car back clean. That delighted and excited me. That's happened to me. Think of the time when you go to a regular coffee shop and you just get an ordinary cup of coffee versus you go to a coffee shop that does one of those amazingly cute little pretty designs for you with the, with the foam or the cream or however they do that. That delights me. When I see a cute little design in my cup, that delights me above and beyond just an ordinary cup of coffee. So think of things that you could do because it's easy to do things to delight and excite your customers. Think of what they would want that would just benefit them. Again, it can be as simple as sending them a message that you're thinking about them, thanking them for their service and offering them something, something for nothing, hello, and making them feel special and that you value them as a customer and a client. That is how you stand out from the competition. Just tickle your customers pink Tickle their fancy and see if competition is no longer an issue for you. Sit, have an awesome day. Go tickle somebody's fancy today in your family or your friends or your business. And I'll, of course, be with you tomorrow. Bye.